listen, let me get to this next topic, right? Yeah, because yeah. there's a big thing about, you know, living within your means and living beyond your means, right? Mm -hmm. And a lot of times when I look at the black community as a whole, we tend to live beyond our beyond means, it, you know yeah, what I mean? Absolutely. More times out of 10. So what's your thoughts on the whole living within your means and living beyond your means? What, what's your thoughts with that? Especially with today's economy, you know what I mean? I feel like in today's economy, it's kind of hard to live beyond your means because you're basically spending all your money on necessities, your rent, your food. Yeah. Like it's, it's hard to go Trying out to live or, and, and, uh, and, yeah. Yeah. You, you, and you need both incomes now. Mm. One income is not going to cut it in this economy. It's just mm. not. So um, you just got to be very conscientious about living within your means. It's very attainable. If there's two people, I feel like it is kind of yeah. hard when it's just one. But when it's two, I feel like it's attainable. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. I'm still thinking. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still thinking. Um, yeah. I was thinking too hard. Y'all can run the question back on you. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so let, let's get to Jew and then Ace real yeah, quick. Uh, and then maybe I got you know, have something to say. Um, I think a lot of people live um, outside of their means. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's almost a natural standard. You get what I'm saying? We all feel like we, and uh, people probably will not want to uh, admit this, but we compete in, amongst each other. Mm -hmm. That's a fact. We don't yeah. want to look poor next to our neighbor. That's you get what I'm saying? And, mm -hmm. and, and when you look at it realistically, we all don't have enough. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Even if I make over 100K a year, that's not, that enough, not to enough to sustain yeah. a enough. house and everything like that. Mm -hmm. Realistically, you get what I'm saying? Like. And shit, I'm on a budget. I got kids. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. So I'm I'm more of on the frugal side. Yeah. And people might shame me. You know, I'm happy that my partner understands that, hey, every day ain't going to be about you with this, whatever. You ain't never getting Birkin, but you know what I'm saying? Whatever right. it is, that's equivalent. Say never, never say never. Right. Right. That no, money listen, is right. That Birkin I would never. Up. I could be a Don't trillionaire. I could and you would a, never I, buy her. And I would never buy a Birkin. You get what I'm saying? Like that's just not the. What if you, that's what she No, really listen. Wanted. Uh, unless she's trying to flip it, then we ain't gonna you. tip it. You get what I'm saying? That's just how it is. I don't believe you. Listen. Go ahead. Talk I, I, you need listen, the burger. Money ain't, ain't the the be all of everything I live for. You get what I'm saying? I understand that you need it to rotate among the atmosphere and and the world and stuff like that. I gotta pay bills and stuff like that. But that's not what makes me happy. And so if that would, if, you about yeah. to exactly. So you're all about making more money. Yeah, I'm all about making things. more money and I'm all about making my kids' life easier. Right. Yeah. And hoping in, in success that they see me and want to make their children's life easier. I had a hard life, so the dollar doesn't value, it's not as much as value to me as it is to another okay, next yeah. person. You're saying that if you had the money still, you still wouldn't buy the birthday. Why would I? But, but what if that's something that your wife really wanted as a gift? What is it? And, and I'm going to iterate to my wife that she don't need a Birkin. It doesn't but determine her life. What she needs but it's a I am. I me as her partner. I do determine what she a, ha what, a, what brings her happiness. And wife? and listen, listen. And what what she determines brings me happiness. A burger communication. A burger would never be a need though. Yeah, it's it'd be a want need. for yeah, sure. But yeah. it's still a gift though. You feel what I'm saying? If someone, if, if you have if my, saying, if she you wouldn't be my wife if a Birkin made her happy in our relationship. I'm not happy, but I'm saying if you had it and it was a gift that she wanted, like, I would. I wouldn't okay. spend my money on a Birkin. And if she left me. I'm happy. So you don't have no like, I mean, desires or something that's like equivalent to a Birkin. That you know what I'm saying. That if you're one, if it's a financial, not, if, if, not that nigga. If you can't afford <laughs> Jordan, <laughs> not listen, that nigga. I mean, Jordan, I Jordan's not. I have, kid, Jordan, but, I have Jordans know? on my feet, but they're not important. And if I can't buy three or ten of them. I would never if, buy them. If you had the money, would you buy and a Lambo? If I can't buy three or ten of them for my children, Jew, I would not buy them. Jew, if you had the money, would you buy a Lambo? No. See? There you go. Wow. He, you will go. Buy, he, he will buy another house. You know what I mean? Yeah. Most likely. Like, he will buy something. For my children. Meaningful. Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. Much, I Have think, you always had that mentality? Always. Yeah. yeah. He's, he's always been like yeah. that. I grew up without parents, so I know every dollar I, I earn, so I deserve it. it and it's my shit. It. I got exactly. you. All I'm going to say is the nigga name is Jew. That's all I'm going to say. J E W W W U. Yeah. W. I mean, Jew. I mean, I think, Slow it down. They, right. this, you. I, I do agree with you. I think, you know, sometimes even when we look at the stats, right? Black Americans spend the most the on most. luxury items, mm -hmm. fast food, uh, across all different ethnic yeah. groups. Um, beauty supplies, um, 
cars. We buy twice yeah. the Mercedes. Don't own shit. Yes. As everybody else, yeah, like, for yeah. what? We got nothing to show yeah. for. Like, you know, And that means we're living beyond our means. Like, what kind of say the things we buy to cover up what's inside? What's that's inside, something yeah. that's been distilled that's in us. Like, we always think, like, we have to look like money. Yo, the, what the Versace, there was a Versace sale in, so, in Soho, Manhattan. Uh -huh. <laughs> blocks lined, shout out to Big Brother. Lined up. Lined up. Ready for, for it. Ten, 10 blocks. And I go down, to, they got to record it. And I, I just see our people on those lines. Yeah. I don't this see white people. Yeah. I don't see Hispanic people. Yeah. I don't see nobody else. It's just our people and they're bum rushing. Fighting too. Yeah. Fighting Ooh. this shit. Like, you get what I'm saying? So it just, yeah, it makes cool. me like, damn, like. I wish collectively we didn't have that mindset, and I I wish we were more frugal mm. with our money and yeah. invested it into places that we need. Bergen is not a black owned um, brand. If it was a black owned brand, maybe I would be like, all right, you know what I mean. I still want to know, but at least it's black owned. Yeah, yeah, it yeah. might be going back into our community. Right. Yeah. That Birkin is not black owned. Fashion Nova, even though black women have helped make Fashion Nova probably the, arguably the most Googled brand in the world, is not black owned. You get what I'm saying? It's, yeah. it's some Indian nigga on this shit, but black women yeah. have made it so popular. It's not even black owned. So we spend all this money on things that things. on non black owned products that mm -hmm. don't give a fuck about. It. It's not going into the black community. It's not doing nothing for the black community, but we're wearing it. We're repping it. Every major brand, uh, luxury brand, black people have made it popular. Like, you know where what you I'm saying? Where do you think that mentality comes from where they feel like they got to spend top dollar on I the, honest, the labels? I honestly, oh, think, I honestly think that black people are meant to be kings and queens honestly you know what i mean at the end of the day i mean so it's in our soul all kanye of us? Said, kanye said all this. of us yeah all of us bro. but it's not about what we're wearing hold on kanye said um what was it kanye i forgot somebody said somebody said somebody said, somebody said yo um <laughs> that's why we addicted to gold because we kings and queens at the end of the day you know what i mean so i think it at in our soul you know what i mean that's why we we gravitate to shit like that and honestly um I also think that's the problem. That, that ain't a good. Yeah. That ain't like, a good. Why isn't our mindset that's go? conditioning, bro? Huh? Like, why isn't our mindsets go? Why are we looking at material things as like when you have because, cars and jewelry and stuff like you made it? Because, but why isn't it like because it because America has told us that that's the equivalent of gold. You know what I'm saying? No, the thing is, you got that. America. You know where it comes from. No, the, the truth is that black people never felt value because so of now, slavery. Yes, mm -hmm. like we really want to be honest. Mm -hmm. So now that they can try to, you know, have money to buy these things, yeah. to show these things, to look like they can fit into, like, a dynamic that's like, bro, like, we don't even right. need to be worrying about and that. That's a, and that's you know another thing. And that's, that's my next point. We want to look like we got money even if we yes. don't got money. You know right. what I mean? So, that's right. the truth. so, and especially to people outside our community. Like, this is what people outside of our community is obtaining. So, in order to look like... I think it's the exact opposite, bro. What do you mean? Because these people are not spending their top dollar on on the shit that you speak of. It, we're competing amongst each other. Mm. We don't want we don't want to look like the littlest nigga mm. I, yeah. in our neighborhood. I don't, I don't agree with that because and, because and, the, and, the reason the reason that we we see these things is because these people have these things, bro. Everybody yeah. cannot be a king and a queen uh -huh. amongst your group, amongst your house. You can be, mm -hmm. but. Like I'm saying, we're competing each other if everybody's a king and queen. A king and queen is a high power to hold. Yeah. Right. You get what I'm saying? There's one leader, there's one queen, mm -hmm. there's one king. You get what I'm saying? So right. we're all competing amongst each other. That's a circle that we're not going to fucking get any no healing or right. building from. Right. That's like how everybody want to be a boss. Like, where the work is at? Yeah. Right. <laughs> exactly. 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 But in, yeah. in this generation, nobody know about being a worker. No. Nope. Everybody, they, they, everybody has been taught to yeah, aim for the stars. You know what I mean? Though, yeah. Lie. Kind of, they doing they, these, they this do generation it. is is no people trying to be scientists. They, everybody trying to be Instagram this and for, and, and twist this and, yeah. and, and first of all, all, they're not doing. It's easier access to money than we had. We wasn't chasing money at opening that. Yo, first of all, we got to stop this. We wasn't selling our ass. LLC is not they. They got they starting a business. Everybody, everybody, anybody could open an LLC. Right, anybody could go to Alibaba and buy lashes and be like, yo, yeah, I got my facts. own business. A lot of these LLCs are facts. failing yeah. in their first year. Yeah. It just yeah. sounds good because you went online and purchased it, an yeah. llc mm. yeah. now i'm a i'm an entrepreneur like your, right, right, right. your business is not making no money yeah, like, you're not, it's not sounds good like, you're not so. putting in the everybody's not meant to do that mm -hmm. right everybody's Wait, so not meant to do that like well, that businesses right now really are like failing because i didn't know there, that. there's a lot there's, there's people filing for like, llc so it looks like there's a lot more businesses but in the first year they say a lot of those business like 90 percent of their businesses fail like they go under yeah this is no this is statistics yeah like i feel like right now like 
the time has changed a little bit just from what i've been seeing like uh -huh. I don't know. Yeah, but you're media? seeing stuff that uh, social media. Like, Everybody looks like they got something. And, they, yeah. and that GoFundMe is done. That GoFundMe and that, um, PPP what's the PPP, PPP is yeah. gone. Well, that shit gone. And, 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 and <laughs> <laughs> they need to run it back. And, and are you and are you following up on these businesses? You might see them yeah. up this today. You go back a few months down the line, they out of I business, see, huh? I see people working though. I see, I see the generation working. Yeah. I've ever seen them working. I see oh, them yeah, spending. Sure. I honestly say that. Yeah, yeah. you gotta spend money to make money. It, like, it's a difference. But but people are really more into businesses now than mm. actually working for somebody like they were right. before. But like, every, that's what I can. But every, say everybody can't be a boss, man. And that's yeah. where yeah. I, yeah. I understand that because for a long time there was different businesses that I wanted to do, yeah. and I could never bring it out like i could never make it come, come to, to fruition, fruition. Yeah. so literally i'm like i thought about it and i'm like i don't need to be an entrepreneur mm -hmm. i don't need to be i'm going to nurse and there's school. nothing there's yeah nothing wrong that's what i want to do yeah there's nothing i'm in the medical field that's yeah. my thing i love yeah. taking care of people i love mm -hmm. being around people like I'm one of those type of people. I like to be able to clock in, know where my money's coming from. I like to know that, okay, I put in all these hours, my check's going to be good. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Like, wow. yeah. I was a real estate agent. Mm -hmm. I didn't make no money. What? Like, I can't live like that. Wow. And I cannot live on being stagnant. Like, yeah. that's just not my personality. Yeah. I'm a Capricorn. I need... not for everybody. I, there's nothing wrong with that. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. And and that's why in our I, society, right. we down people that want to just want to work. Yeah. Oh, you're yeah. not trying to be an entrepreneur. You're not trying to be a boss. Like, yeah. oh, you're yeah. working like, a white oh, man that's, for the rest yeah, of that's, your life. We, we, we down the average person right. and it's like we need average people we do. in order for exactly. the for the especially in the medical field yeah right. like I, I don't think those, those are average people by the way yeah. but i but we need average yeah. people in order for the for the economy to to you know what i mean go up you know what i mean yeah and i think by downing the average people we're actually hurting ourselves you know what I mean? yeah. yeah when you say average people like yeah. what do you mean average people is like um people that don't but, Average people is the norm. Like average is the norm, basically. You know what I mean? People that's going it, out and working, like you know most, I mean? yeah, most people are average. You know what I mean? Like that's yeah. it. Uh, there's a greater percentage of average people than it is. Than it is. Than it is. Yeah. It. Yeah. Okay, if you're okay with that. Exceptional, you gotta be the top of the top yeah. to be exceptional. Yeah. And, a lot of pressure. And everybody, yeah, right. yeah, exactly. Yeah. Everybody want to be there, but mm -hmm. it's, it's a lot. It's a lot that comes yeah, with that. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Listen. Mm -hmm. Listen, man, we do got to get up out of here. Um, mm -hmm. I did enjoy this conversation. I like, definitely I did too. Yeah.